I am here to say something and knowledge about outside of India. So people from outside India also can see this video as a education purpose. So it is uh, India is a country. They will say they. Uh, it is also known as Bharat or anything that you tell Hindustan or something. But it have this country details and growth, uh, GDP, culture, technology, services and monuments. I will not teach services because now it is not uh, possible for me to add some other slides because the video in would increase. But indirectly I will talk about some services of India. Basic knowledge about India. Independent form. It is independent from Britishers, UK and independence day is 15th august 1947 which is also the national day of india 15th august india's richest time was 1080 to 70 50 AD. after that british came and take away all things of india past gdp was 25 percent average rich for its prices jewelry and some other fields and it was very very rich 25 percent average it means uh, what time would reach very very rich it was to say 1080 to 70 50 very very rich but uh, before 1080 also it was rich but not so 25,000 it could be that something gdp was 20 percent 19 percent like that but not 25 percent but 1080 to 1750 was 25 percent means very very means very very good uh, gdp growth of india very very best gdp growth it is a best gdp growth it was going good but british came the British came in the 18th century and some other countries too. Mughal Empire is not a country but it is a caste you can say. It came, uh, it is the first that came, then Portugal and then many other countries too. Netherlands, uh, many countries. Portugal, Netherlands, many many countries came in India. But they do not come to rule India. They What they do is they... They just came to trade in India because India was a very rich country. They came to trade in India. But suddenly they thought that uh, in this country, if we uh, set up our uh, um, our own power and set up this country's rule, so we can do. So they set up East India Company first, but East India Company has failed and uh, removed from the market by British. And now the British government managed in India because they think that it is very rich and uh, it is a very rich country and we can do it. We can do it. Uh, they applied force much, but that time uh, making India the loser, it is very, very hard because the uh, army was very, very strong, but they all, they won. That is their... Uh, lucky but uh, i don't think that they should do this so it's having the strongest military force now also in the world and it is a second populous country it is not so good but it is a second populous country china is one enemy of india and russia japan america or some not uh, it's not america uh, which uh, uh, friends it, it is not friends of india so now we will go to the capital which is delhi Delhi situation we can say that uh, middle middle we can say middle but in the north side of little north upwards than the middle and the exact middle little upwards of India so national symbols of India uh, some fruit national fruit if we talk about is mango that's the element is lower Bengal tiger it is from the Bengal Sundar ones in the East India National bird is peacock. National song is Vande Mataram, which was written by Bangim Chandra Chatarji. And uh, National Day is 15th August because in that day India got independence. National anthem is Janaganamana, ruled by Rabindranath Tagore of East India. Indian science and technical growth. We talk about the starting of science and technology. India was much developed in it. It described many science theories like prediction of eclipses, rotation, and evolution of the earth, and introduced eye with the medicine system. Some great Indian scientists are Arivata, Chiraka, Shishruta, and Vamagupta. After 1947, India became little low in technology and science and became pure. It, its life was fully dependent on neighbor countries. So, what happened is, uh, India was a very rich in technology, also, it was very rich because some scientists like uh, Aryavata, Charaka, Shushruta, uh, they came and uh, they are very, very means they increased in the system of technology. But really, India was very, very rich country. India was a good and a very, very rich country. 
so i think that india would now also do it if it develops it's a faster development country now also so let's see what happened but after 1947 the technical growth and science was little no not so much and but it it will become much poor but now it is not so poor it is uh, little reach you now then then that time it is reach for much gdp growth so 1947 current year development since what is the development of 1947 current year so first of all little we little we should go about to go to economy india is the first developing country gdp now is 4% but if you talk about science it developed in science also it's much developed in space research there's another scientific fields space is a certainly it is very very rich and very very good India first started developing in 1950s to 60s by industries. It launched industries and only then, then only India developed in science, technology, or economy also we can say. The industries by seeing from the other country, India set say, uh, uh, set up some industries in it and now it founded water in moon, the first country to find water in moon and on also developed the first country to send a satellite into Mars. So it must develop the 1947. so really good thing for india uh, but so but uh, now also india can develop it so uh, sent the first country to send a satellite to mars was india and uh, it's much developed than 1947 by 2000 is to tens with mars people to mars and develop more it should means it can be the descend in 2035 40 50 time but i think india could be the country who sends the first uh, uh, rocket to uh, the mars but it can be but uh, i can't see now 1947 so let's let's go to uh, science first so science it is we should try we should try and uh, develop our country so it is let's see but india would develop it is a very very good developing country and it should do it should it should uh, it is a very good country in economics in technology now also but it, it can if it if um, it does but india is a main country of technology if i say india is a main country so without india anything not happens anything not happens i am saying it does india anything not happens I am I am seeing personally because in India only in better science and technology develop the science and technology. See without the scientists, this type of scientists are you going to ah charaka? How would the world develop? Say me first. Are you with the in very very olden times? He said that the ah uh, the ah uh, science that ah uh, rotation, evolution, some prediction will be some some ah. Uh, Theory is developed, and now modern scientists came and really they are amazed to see that that how can he see it? And she said that also amazing invent in the uh, Ayurveda medicine. It is amazing, really. So it only done uh, all things, and now uh, all countries another countries are developed. But I think India would develop. So let's go to the next side. Now let's enter economical growth. Nineteen hundred forty-seven to two thousand twenty-one economical the growth. The previous economical growth I taught taught only that India was a country that uh, uh, was very very was very very rich, but British came and take away all. In the eighteenth century, India was richest in Asia. India India was richest in Asia. I don't know that in the world it was richest or not, but it it is it is see all that it is it was richest in India. Sorry, Asia. From nineteen hundred forty-seven, India started developing in economical fields. Not from nineteen hundred forty-seven. Not I would say that independence. You should give the independence here only. But from nineteen fifty, it gets started. Not nineteen hundred forty-seven, but it is near to nineteen hundred fifty only. Its first attempt was made in fifties to sixties. Means suppose, ah, uh, sorry, 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 very, very sorry. So uh, the no. Suppose fifty to six seventy, it was launching industries. GDP is now the main point that I am waiting about to say you. 
GDP is based on countries, companies, customer quantity and Chinese and countries own product customers. So being an India, if you buy Chinese product, it's not good for India. So please buy Indian product. Example, do not buy Xiaomi, Samsung, South Korean, but still not Indian. I would say um, at least not buy the Chinese brands. At least. Uh, I also use this brand, but I do. I will not uh, buy any more this brand. I will hate. I am hating this brand now. Vivo or Realme by Micromax. Always by Micromax, please. People say, na, this is very very good. People don't. I think they can't understand the main point. They say it is very very good, very very good, very very good performance. Now see, they don't know anything. What I will do? So next one is brands we should use. Government requests. Uh, sorry, sorry. Government requests uh, us to use Swadeshi brands, which is a Hindi term means Indian brands, means the uh, brands of India only. So Micromax, Infinix, Tata brands like Voltas mm-hmm. Limited, Titan Limited. So. Uh, titan limited and others we should use so there are many points we should learn about and also there is many many points that we should take and infinix tata brands and voltas limited titan limited sonata limited tata cars like altro this is hero india more recommended but hero honda india japan india also controls it japan also controls it this is less recommended and brands like microsoft or google should be hated I also hate it, but I have to use Microsoft only for sure. You, Google also I hate it. But what is the chance of us? Anyone not is anyone saying that we should use the we should invent one software? Anyone just Microsoft is good, Google is good, Google is best. Anyone not says only that we should use the Indian brands. Should be hated. I I hate it. But what will do? Any software is only not invented. I also try to invent one software, but uh, it is not so. It is not so. Um, uh, work for me. It is a work for the programmers, but they are not so good. They program for the countries of America and other countries. Should be hidden and should be banned by the government. If this happens, India would use their own brands and develop an economy. Economy only is to develop. Technology economy both should it should develop because when we invent the Indian brand, then equal it. GDP growth is increased and uh, the economy will increase. So we should use both Indian opposition, which is a example, and in our computers in the place of MS Windows, which also I hated. Uh, Indian culture and natural beauty. Indian culture is really unique. Here, every part or state has its own culture, like the Luchi in Bengal and Chola Vetera in Delhi. Indian cuisine is the best. The spices of India are of golden dust. These are the Kona's masala in Hindi. Most spoken Indian language is Hindi. When it comes to cloth, every state has its own cloth. So, men of Bengal wear dhoti um, Punjabi, but in Gujarat, men wear kurtas. In the India, the most population are Hindus. 75% of are Hindus, and another part of 25% are Christians and Muslims. The most the state which has the most natural beauty is Kashmir in India because the Himalayas. Uh, is present in it. Himalayas also is there in the India. Uh, Manigali is one of the famous state where it comes to nature. It is a wasted place of all the world. Clean is Asia, situated in Meghalaya, and Meghalaya is a beautiful place. I know what is the speciality of Himalaya. I don't have to say it. And the spices are a golden test here. It 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 introduced spice many time ago, but now also the spices are a golden test. Really, really. The spice that the whole world eats you know, is of India, and uh, the spices are known as masala. And Hindi is the most spoken Indian language. In Hindi only, India is known as Bharat or Hindustan. When it comes to the cloth, Bengal, uh, Bengal, which was Bengal was the previous uh, capital of India. When nineteen hundred twelve, uh, it was removed by the British government, and uh, then Delhi was the capital. Bengal with Dhoti Punjabi, sorry, Bengal with Dhoti Punjabi in uh, and India has a more India really uh, having a unique culture that every state have its own culture. It is a unique culture. When you talk about the historic monuments, the first thing come to our mind is the Taj Mahal in Agra in Uttar Pradesh, which is an UNESCO World Heritage Site and also one of the seven wonders of the world. 
It was built by Mughals. The first person to name who built this was Hajan, who was a Mughal king. Also, much monuments are built by Mughals, either there for in Delhi. Many other monuments are there, like Victoria Memorial being wall, built by Britishers, and Kutumina Akshadan Temple, Delhi's Agra's and Nerfor, and Jantar Mantar, which is built by Maharaja Jai Singh too. And also Golden Temple in Punjab, uh, which is a very very good uh, taste. The taste that gives the bhog. Bhog is the special name. Bhog means the prasad of the means the thing that the god had eaten. The thing that human ate. That is that is known as prasad or bhog. And the bhog is of golden taste. Very very good. Very very golden taste. It is very very tasty. They give two chapatis and I think dal, but this is very very tasty and it is also uh, very unique and it is also a tradition of India, a uh, traditional food of India, which is made of gold. The second temple, Odisha, Lal Kila, and some places like Prince of Ghat in Bengal, as well as other monuments and also Lotus Temple. This is a Lotus Temple. It is a modern design. Taj Mahal, see, Taj Mahal is made of Brahmakarana marble, and it is seven wonders of the world. And it changes its color. It is very very clean. So when it comes to the state, um, is the state of Delhi, sorry, the state of Uttar Pradesh, it contains the Taj Mahal, and it is very 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 very. It is very very. Uh, uh, you can say this very very. Very very. It is rich. Uh, we have to. Get some much money Mughals spent in this because it is very very unique. It changes its color also. It is made of Mankara marble, which is which bought by Rajasthan. So one thing we learn today is we should use Indian products always, always. We should use Indian products only. What happened? We should use Indian Mughals. Only.